Neat snow treat for those you eat. Go vegan, guys. That's no chicken, that's a shame. Not a nugget. Chickens just want to live, guys. Go vegan. Honestly, they can jazz it up any way they want, but the meat agriculture industry is killing our planet, and there's no way that it's green. Go vegan, guys. How many times do I gotta say it? So you could say that meat is not murder. You know how I prove meat is murder? Those are drumsticks, those are legs. And uh, I believe the legs, oh, the chicken thighs. Do they look like they're gonna run around anytime soon? No, because they were murdered. You see a fish fillet. I see a murdered animal that just wanted to live. Fish are friends, not food. Go vegan, guys, for the fishies. Combined handiwork from yesterday. And today, honestly, how much good it does to put stickers in these places, I really have no idea. But the bottom line is, you know, unless you can afford to shop at a place that deals exclusively in vegan products, which most of us can't, you know, I, I know that um, there's not even a place like that near where I live, so I end up shopping in places like Walmart or other grocery stores. It's, it's where I can afford, man. It's where I live. It's just the way it is. So, you know, you're obviously confronted with all sorts of crap. Um, I'm here. I don't know. Looks like just sauces behind me, but you know, it's it's just uh, you're just overwhelmed with the, the evil that these places bring. And uh, sometimes you just want to put a couple stickers out. It's not really not really hurting anything. I've heard heard a bit of feedback from people who say, well, if they put it, they find a sticker on a package of meat, they have to throw it all the meat. Uh, I'd like to know your thoughts on that. If the, is, is that true? And if it is true, is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's costing them money, it's hitting the bottom line. As far as I know, nobody's putting stickers on vegan products. So um, I don't really know. I'm not forming an opinion on that one way or the other. Uh, I'll leave that to you. Is it a good thing or a bad thing if these places have to throw out meat? It's obviously wasteful to the, the, you know, the killing animals that are being wasted, but at the same time, as animal activists, we kind of want them to stop killing animals at all, so is it a means to the end? Uh, let me know your opinions. I'm gonna keep on stickering. I just wanna know what you, what, you, uh, what you think of it all. All right, bye. Here's one for the chickens. Chickens are the most abused animals on the planet. See their eggs. Set them free, guys. Yeah, as you can see behind me, I got the bodies of murdered animals behind me, and um, it just goes on and on. You know, these cases are huge. Just the um, yeah, it just goes on and on with this. You know, um, you can put stickers out and do everything you want, but at the end of the day, it's supply and demand. You know, as long as people are willing to buy this garbage, uh, they're going to keep selling it. You know, that's just the way it is. So as consumers, it's kind of up to us. You know, we actually hold the power. You know, I mean, we hold the power of making the decision where our money goes. At the end of the day though, um, advertising, uh, peer pressure, all that stuff is a huge, huge factor. And um, the bottom line is uh, we're inundated with advertisements telling us that that's what we want. We want the, we want the meat, we want the eggs, we want the dairy. They're, they're telling us that. We want this junk food, this poison behind me. Let's pop. At the end of the day, man, I mean, it's, it's, if you're a kid, if you're a teenager, it's hard to fight against that. You know, I mean, it took me 40 years to kind of figure out, figure out that I was being tricked. And even then, you know, the conditioning is so strong. It took me, it took me quite a while to go full vegan. And I still get cravings for this kind of crap every once in a while, you know? And, um, this is the way it goes. All right, uh, let me know what you think. Mm-hmm. <laughs>